Hey, my name's Sean. Welcome to Echoes in Eternity Bourbon. Have you ever found your perfect tender bourbon? So, I don't know much about dating site apps. I've been married now for coming on 15 years. Um, and I know the dating site apps are out, but I know that there's something called Tinder and you swipe one way or the other. If you see something that really intrigues you, if bourbon had a dating site app, this would be something I would be swiping for. So those in the comments tell me, is it left or right? I don't know. But when I look at this, we've got Starlight Distilleries, Carl T. Huber's. This is a cigar batch. Finished in Amburana. For those who watch channel know I love Amburana finishes. Selected by Benny's coming in at 111.9 proof. You're talking my proof points. So the curves are good there. Amburana cask. There's some excitement, some intrigue there. Cigar batch. I absolutely love the way that you get a bunch of different tastes. Selected by Benny's. Hardcore. Sent in from someone that watches this channel. Dave Vogel saying, I do thank you so, so very much for this. I truly appreciate this. You know, Dave, if those that don't know, Dave is an avid bourbon hunter. He finds stuff all the time. And I had made mention that this was one that I was looking for. And, and Dave, you absolutely hooked me up. Thank you so very much for this. You know, I've had so many awesome people. Well, that was a nice whistle on the show, but so many awesome people contribute to this channel. Dave, you're one of them. You you watch the videos. You you tell me about your hunts, and I'm truly excited when you get something new. You know, I love when some people get some good stuff. It always makes me happy. And then you contribute to the channel. You've gotten me samples in the past, and, and this bottle right here. Thank you again. I mean, within a week, you know, I've got... Eric, Terrence, and now Dave that have done amazing things that, to help put me on some amazing stuff. So I am looking forward to this. Whatever this would have been a left or right, I'm swiping for this one because you hit all of my tater must-haves. So definitely looking forward to this. Weekend is here. Full slate of NFL preseason starting Thursday night, running all the way through Sunday. I'm going to see my daughter. Uh, and her husband and the grandkids. So I'm recording this on Friday. It'll, it'll release on Saturday. So hopefully the Dolphins did good tonight. I'll be watching them tonight. But let's get into this starlight. Looking forward to this. I mean, I get tobacco off the nose on this. How, how awesome is that? Get a little bit of honey, get some uh, uh, kind of a, a bready earthiness to this as well. I get a light, uh, light, sweet mintiness to it as well. So a lot of things going on on the nose, just dripping down the side of the glass. So super oily. Looking forward to seeing how this is. I have absolutely loved the cigar batches. I love the complexities with them. Just did a cigar batch recently and Sunday be drawn for the winner of who gets the four different cigar batch samples plus the 10 and 11 of the Chattanooga founder plus the winner of the blind. They'll get a sample of that plus whatever other things I decide to throw in because I just like to, to throw stuff in. Getting some uh, oak on this as well. Let's see what we get on the palate. Wow. Super oily mouthfeel. Then you kind of get that cinnamon burst, tobacco burst, getting some honey on this as well. Man, I'm still getting that nice cinnamon on this. I absolutely love the Ambirana cast because I'm a big cinnamon fan. So it's it's kind of like you're getting tobacco with some cinnamon toast crunch flavored with some honey. 
right off the bat on this. This just feels very soft on the mouth. It's got an absolute great mouthfeel to it. You get a little bit of that tingling now from the cinnamon. You get a little bit of burn in the chest, but it's not overwhelming. And that cinnamon kind of ramps back up into like a cinnamon toast crunch flavor. So you're getting two types of cinnamon, almost like it's something that was fresh off a cinnamon stick and then a sweet cinnamon that kind of creeps back up on the back of the palate. It's like a cinnamon toast crunch with that great mouthfeel that's going on with it. You should just see the way this just sheens down the glass. This is absolutely amazing. Still getting that honey. So you're getting like a rich honey with it. I almost get like a little orange peel uh, on the nose. Not getting a whole lot of citrus or orange on the palate. But as I was drinking the last drink, I was smelling it a little bit too. And I said, man, I get a little scent or something. But it's more on the nose. And this is sweet. And, and those who know, I like my sweet bourbons. So you're getting the sweet, you're getting the honey, you're getting the cinnamon on the front, and then it kind of washes back on the back of the palate, kind of like the cinnamon toast crunch. Um, getting some tobacco, getting some oaks, so you get a little bit of the dryness on the back. Outstanding pour. Uh, absolutely in love with this bottle, right off the blush on the first one on this. This is going to make it tough on my other cigar blends. I, I'm... And for those that have an opportunity to get this, this one I think was going around $80 if you can find it. Find this. Get it. If you like cigar blends, if you like cinnamon, this will be right in your alley. Now, if you're not a cinnamon fan, avoid this at all costs because this is cinnamon heavy. Bam. It's got the... Almost like a pastry quality, too, on that mid palate that I'm kind of getting. So as I'm drinking it, I'm still getting the heavy cinnamon presence, still getting the tobacco and oak, but now it's developing is I'm kind of getting a pastry buttery quality on the mid palate. Kind of get... You know what this reminds me of? It. What's the name of that cinnamon roll place? In the mall, they have them a lot of times. I can't think of the name of them for the life of me. Now, of course, when I get off video, I'll think of what they are. Uh, is it Cinnabon? Cinnabon. This is what it kind of reminds me of Cinnabon a little bit. Um, I get kind of a creaminess to it, kind of get a vanilla with it now. You're getting the pastry taste. You're getting the really sweet, sweet cinnamon that goes with it. But then you get on the back, you get some dryness from the tobacco and from the oak. Man, this is this is a very, very nice pour. And you know what's so neat? Because I kind of started off with this dating app for bourbon thing. Man, after the first date, I might be asking this one to marry me. I mean, it's not only it's the it's not only the looks, but the the insides of this are fantastic. The juice is great. You know, in a week's period, I've had three different people give me three phenomenal bottles. And, you know, I am so absolutely appreciate that and, and so blown away, blown away by the generosity of you, Eric, Terrence, Dave. You, you guys have just given me things that I haven't been able to find in this area. And let me share it with a lot of people as far as what my thoughts are on it. Um, and, and I absolutely appreciate it. I appreciate all of you out there who continue to grow this channel. Uh, at the time this video is going out, there's 910 um, people that are members of this channel. I truly appreciate it. Um, push into 1,000 because there will be some giveaways and stuff for that. Looking forward to that. Looking forward to Sunday to getting some other things in there. I have to add a sample of this Sunday now 
You can tell, then you'll have five cigar blends. Fantastic. Dave, thank you again. I hope you and your family are having a very nice weekend all. I hope you guys have a great time. I hope you're enjoying some games or enjoying some time with your family. Cheers, God bless, and have an amazing day.